Cognition is the realm of thinking. Metacognition is the realm of thinking about thinking, not thinking about the phenomenon of thought in general or the nature of knowledge in the philosophical sense, but reflecting on your own thinking process. If cognition is what happens in your mind while you're engaged in learning, metacognition is what happens in your mind when you're engaged in monitoring and managing your learning. Consider painting a self-portrait. There are two levels of activity. There's painting, the touch of the brush to the canvas. Then there's meta-painting, the painter's awareness and regulation of the painting. As the metacognitive painter reflects on his work, he draws on his knowledge of painting in several ways, an awareness of what colors complement each other, an understanding of which brush strokes produce different effects, and the discernment of when to apply different techniques and use certain brushes to achieve the desired result. The reflective painter also manages his own painting as he goes along. He is mindful of how he plans to use the space of the canvas. He monitors his progress to make sure he is staying on track. And he evaluates his work, constantly checking that the paint on the canvas reflects the image on his mind and in the mirror. Whether it's painting or the knowledge and skills of any other discipline, we want our students to not only be critical and creative thinkers, but also to become reflective about their learning. As students face an ever-increasing demand on their attention and an ever-broadening world available for consideration, an important part of helping them think for themselves is helping them think about their own thinking.